Dogs are afraid, but their heads are still doing it. Necessity will guide us to the revolution. As the red and blue dogs bite each other, we will come with the leashes. May God bless the revolution. <laughs> my instincts much sooner and shot you when I first met you. You completely destroyed my entire operation, destabilized the red team, all the while the blue and brown team consolidate power. The only person loyal to me is this foul creature dog. You were drinking shrimp cocktails while you paid us in food stamps. That isn't the red team that I joined. <laughs> so what? I am a capitalist. I provide the services. Without me, this stinking country would be controlled by a band of smelly hippies! Hey, can't we just use the teleporter? <laughs> That path ain't safe, fellas. I'll fix the elevator any second now. <sighs> Scout! You useless skinny man! Which zodiac sign are you? What the hell? Gemini? Oh, good. Gemini. I can trust you. You see, I think there's a conspiracy. Well, yeah. Engineer's been acting kind of weird, but he's the only thing keeping this team together. No, no. It's something else. Like a Bigfoot or an alien Bigfoot. Uh, shut up! We'll sneak together, you know? Please don't kill me! We can strike a deal. <laughs> Did he say, dig your graves, or I like Dave's? Does he look like a person of heterosexual orientation to you? Jesus, help us, God. I will finally read the New Testament if you help us. For a red team. This territory is dangerous. Come here. Oh, God works in mysterious ways. How are you? You only conscious being. Before we move on, I want to tell you about something. There's this book from the 19th century. I carry it around everywhere I go. I'm interested. I know. So the first chapter goes like this. Zarathustra, after living in a cave for 20 years, learning about virtues, decides to leave this place. He has been nurtured by the sun for 20 years. Would you know who he sees when going down the straw in the mountains? A priest. Would you know what he says to him? Haven't you heard? That God is dead. <laughs> this is all symbolic mumbo jumbo, but I know that you know what this means. <laughs> now get the wrangler. Oh my god! 
Addicting the boss to Bonk was such a brilliant part of this whole plan! Oh, I've been pretty useful in all this. You've got to give me that. So this trick with the dispenser again. Stop being cynical, partner. Cynical? Yo, look at this state of soldier. You, you took our weapons away. Ah, we'll fight with sticks like 13th century Bushmen. I didn't like that stick anyways. You know what, partner? As cynical as I may be, the red team represents much more than you think. We'll stick by your side till the end, big man. On the other hand, the blue team went dead silent. I suppose the 10th class is doing our work. So, come before the mines. Will we find the red respawn crystal there? Share as the sun, buttercakes. How do you know this? We've got our ways to find out the truth. All right, all right, all right. I'll sing like a bird. I'll tell everything. Now tick-tock, capitalist pig! I mean, uh, we'll get our team Do you know what's the best part of all of this? We'll bring about world peace after the red team is gone! Oh god, please let it be here, oh my god, please let it be here! Oh my god, it is here. The red respawn crystal. It has been fueling wars for the past 2,000 years. Why did it take so long to find it? Can I be let go now? Uh, who cares? Destroy the respawn crystal! And so with this watch, everything began, Spy. Hey, Fruits! Is that what you choose to concern yourself with? Whoa, well, well, what's with the hostility? Well, I just realized that you both are desert tees. Well, so are you. You have brown clothes, and we are reaching the green territory. <laughs> Shut up, Socrates! Logic is for pansies. The red team provided one good thing in this stinking world. Freedom. And violations of the Geneva Convention. <laughs> Men like Jesus and General MacArthur! Men like these have a duty from God to serve humanity. You are one of those men, I can tell. But if it's freedom you want, then I will show you freedom. be keeping an eye on you too. Ah, so this is how the green team controls half the world. Yes, that sort of power at work. One cannot just conquer half the world without some rhythm and blues. My god! Thank you for having the courage to take us here. All right, all right. Easy there, buddy. Red team, come here! Running low on energy, huh? I can give you something to spice things up a bit. Coffee will do for now, unless you want to see God, though. So, as I was saying, um, you need to reject material goods, man. Take a page out of this guy's book and hand me back the $2,000! Get your hands off my suit. 
The money may come in handy later. Hey, so the three of you, how did you end up here? We kind of spontaneously became army desertees. Anyway, so this party kind of died down. <laughs> Not many thanks to this. That's indeed true. Would you like to come to my place? Hey, spy! We've got the opportunity to not sleep on wet concrete with seven sweaty men! Medic, take a second to realize this. Our plan kind of worked. This is beautiful. I know. Can I come with you guys? I'm so alone. I even lost my foul creature dog. All right, but I am not giving you the $2,000 back. <laughs> That's okay. I'm completely financially stable. I was foolish, Medic. We need to help the Red Team. I was about to say the same thing, my god! We really think alike! I know. Let's fight for the freedom of the Red Country. And deal with the consequences later. You know the drill, folks. Don't make any sudden movements and give us your belongings. Hey, my two thousand dollars! Not again! What? What are you doing here? I've been following you around. Tell us more. You know what they say. Big-legged hippie mamas will give you the troubles. How is it decided? Are you willing to fight for the red team? We haven't got anything to fight with, aside from a profound sense of inadequacy. What about this? <laughs> but soldier, but who would sell us weapons without thinking of the consequences? Good choice, 9mm. It's good for potential encounters with Bigfoot or aliens. I'll buy all of this. You got a permit? <laughs> you almost got me. <laughs> hey, spy. We are back to basics. Medic, you are exquisite. <sighs> Nobody listen. But all of my conspiracy theories came true. Aside from Alien Bigfoot, I need to do some more research on that one. <sighs> the soldier think. What could this man possibly want to do? Idiot. This is real power. Rocket launches in three, <laughs> two, one. You have a commanding lead. Yes, yes, we've launched the rocket. How could he do this? We Americans have never dropped an atomic bomb, especially on the... Uh, I must stop them, even if it's the last thing I do!
Hey, I hope you enjoyed the movie. So, this project actually means a lot to me. I've been creating it for the past 5 years and I'm so happy that you are still on this journey with me. This video took me 4 months of work as opposed to the last one which took me 8 months of work. I'm getting faster at this. With that, Muse Trigger, Dr. Hoctor, Last in Eden helped a lot by breathing life into this video by recording the voice lines. We, just like the last time, were guided by my psychotic recordings. Me, I'm the soldier, me. You took our weapons away. Good. We will fight with the sticks like 13th century bushmen. Well, I didn't like the stick anyways. When I began making SFM videos, I relied on Dust Early to make visual effects for my videos. However, now I make them from scratch and I decided to release them for free on my Steam Workshop account and hopefully they will help you start your own SFM adventure. And also I plan on engaging you far more in the creative process through my Discord server, while at the same time I will be collaborating on the animation with more people just like in the About the Scout Who Never Give Up days. Before the video ends, I encourage you to follow me on other social media, where you can follow my artistic progress and also my boring life. That is all, take care and see you soon. Bye.